Well, it is that special time of the year where everyone starts as equals. Far back in the distance, memories of last season, positions and points tallies on the last day. That's all now irrelevant. It is all about the ultimate prize that lies a long way ahead. That buoyant feeling is here. New start, fresh hope. Get the season off to a flyer. The fans are believing. And we have in front of us this gloriously imposing arena, absolutely picture-perfect for a game of this nature. So everybody starts on nothing. Last season is in the past, they are all equals. Well, with star names and new faces, both on the pitch and on the bench, let's hope for a, a more attractive, competitive and unpredictable league. We would appear to have a high-caliber meeting with very little at stake. But then you consider a, a chance for one or two of the fringe players to get a look in, and this becomes a big incentive. It changes the dynamic. So there's plenty at stake for them, which will do no harm to the energy levels, and the overall conviction, and hopefully, the style of contest. There's the whistle, and here we go. So, Jim, tell me this, who are you looking for in particular here? Well, a man who splits opinion, David Luiz. Is he a midfielder or a defender? I would say the former, because he has an impetuous streak that can't be trusted at the back, but full of Brazilian flair, and, and what a shot. Yes, he'd be my pick too. It's going to be all about how they get the best out of him. And it's Shaw. Bruno Fernandes. Tierney. Aubameyang. Aubameyang was alert to the possibilities, but in the end it's fruitless. Pogba. Martial. Arsenal have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's it's a bold attempt, in my opinion, to occupy the opposition in a way they're not expecting. Now the breakaway, Greenwood, he's through, now is he in? Can he fight? Goes for goal! Goal! Manchester United! Manchester United take the lead! The breakaway clinical and clean, and the finish unerring. Well, talking about being hit on the break, the ball was in their net before they could even organise their defence. It was fast and furious, and all but unstoppable. Going through, Bearing delivers, hits one! He's done very well to get to that. Oh, that's a sparkling save, absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra-sharp. <laughs> Played it short. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Defending, albeit from an unexpected source. 
you have to admire commitment like that because he could easily ignore that and just kind of walk around and let others do all the chasing but instead he looks as if he relishes the chance to uh, to dig in for his team here gets up to head it and he's there to make a great save Shaw goes looking Martial gets the better of his man Greenwood Tierney gets into the right position to intercept. Hector Behrin tries lifting it over. He's in, surely. He's gone for it. They've done it. They have grabbed themselves an equaliser. With time and space aplenty, he was never going to miss. Well, considering he has a bit of a, a shoot-on-sight policy, he was the one player that should have been picked up then. It was both careless and costly from where I'm sitting. And that has added a whole new complexion to the game. Oh, look, Peter, I was on the fence before a ball was kicked, and uh, I still haven't moved. It's Greenwood! Oh, that's a terrific save from the keeper. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. Maguire does well to read it and intercepts. It's Hector Berrien. Willock. Obama Yang has a pop! Hector Berrien. Great leap! Oh, fine stop from the keeper. Well, as Tesco Peter, the keeper has just received an A plus grade. And here's Obama Yang going for goal! Oh, real danger here. Willock. Bayerine. William. Popper. Bruno Fernandes. Rashford. Martial! Goal! Manchester United! And they get themselves in front! Oh, it's a keeper's nightmare, Peter. He just couldn't pick up on it until it was way too late having so many bodies in front of him. get there he's making good use of his strength there just refuses to be out muscled <laughs> away from immediate danger and it's Shaka he's gone for it oh that was no routine save well what can I say truly wonderful goalkeeping there's the end of the first half. So a really good half of football. Three goals and just one separating them. It's kind of a hard one to call, Peter, isn't it? I mean, from what we've seen so far, both sides have provided ample evidence that they can add more goals, and I'm sure their respective managers have reminded them that the next one 
will be pretty crucial. So it's going to be interesting to see how the teams come out for the next period. And the second half gets on the way. Mustafi. Caballos. And here's Aubameyang. Genduzi plays it out to the wing. It'll be a throw in. Hector Bellerin. Hector Bellerin goes upfield. Caballos. Tierney. Genduzi. Caballos. Driving on, he could shoot here. Obama has a hit! That has certainly tested the keeper. Obama Yang simply didn't do anything wrong. He was thwarted by brilliance. Lindelof tries to get it forward quickly. Martial drives it forward. Caballos. And here's Aubameyang. Aubameyang. Rashford. It's the through ball. He's got away. Greenwood. Now it's Martial. Granit Xhaka. Aubameyang. He's had a shot. And that's caused a worry or two. Obama Yang just denied by a lick of paint. We're talking centimeters. The ball needed to be better there. It's a wasted chance. Martial. Hit into the middle. Tierney and it's William and here's Aubameyang Aubameyang and Aubameyang goal finishing doesn't come simpler than that bang in front of goal Aubameyang is the obvious danger man here, and yet he was afforded way too much freedom. I think he was gifted that goal. His reputation should have been warning enough for them. Granit Xhaka. Tierney looks to get on the end of this. William is on to it and can take it up. Martial tries a shot! to the lead once more. He does it all with an air of efficiency and simplicity. Well, was there ever any doubt? It made it look like he's done it over and over and over again, and he has. His second of the game, and an eye now for the hat-trick. Played out to the right, gets away from his opponents, he's had a go! No, just couldn't quite turn it in. I have to commend the wing play, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross.
Genduzzi with a delicate ball. Right through the middle. Oh, has a goal! It's broken. Oh, that is asking for trouble. Juan Bissaka plays it forward. Martial. Arsenal are actually displaying tremendous fighting spirit. There's a real belief that they can still have a say. And back out it comes. Manchester United are looking to make this one safe. They want to reduce the risk. It's a Bamiya. Shoots! Oh, that could cost them. Makes you think, Peter, they could have been doing this earlier. Still, it's encouraging. Bruno Fernandes. Martial. Yeah, it's safe to say that they just need to manage this to secure the win now. Mustafi with the clearance. Manchester United can afford to settle on seeing this one out by running down the clock, I think. And here's Rashford, Van der Beek, Martial. Manchester United just have to run down the clock. And back to base. And that's it. Manchester United win it by the odd goal. Almost nothing in it. Perhaps a draw would have felt fairer. But that's the game, and they have won it at the margin. Your final thoughts, Jim? Yeah, looking back on this, the early goal had a big influence on what unfolded and allowed them to dictate with comfort. Let me, and as the fans make their way home, so must we. Good evening to you.